Okay, guys, so I'm here to recap another fight from the UFC on Fox 11 card, and this time it's Joao Romero versus Brad Tavares. Now, similarly to Habib Nurmagomedov in the last fight, Joel Romero had his way with Brad Tavares. Yo, Joel Romero, in order to set up his takedowns, would either go a left side kick, a left front kick, or a, a, a leaping left hand where he would leap forward and break you so you could get your guard up and then he would change levels and take you down. Brad Kavares couldn't do anything about this for the three rounds. All he was able to get working was the left outside leg kick, which didn't do that much. But Joel Romero was able to constantly kick down Brad Kavares, and when they were on the feet, Brad Kavares was hesitant to come in and unleash on Joel Romero just because he could go. Yo, Alvaro Romero would break you back, or one time he caught him with an elbow coming in, with sliced him open on the top of his head. So, Brad Kavarik wasn't able to kick anything, and Yo, Alvaro Romero just dominated him. A couple times, he did a couple variations of the duo go, but didn't go much with the takedown, just like Khabib and the Magomedo. He just got the takedown and wore down Brad Tavares. Next win for Joel Romero. I think he should face either Michael Bigman or Kim Kennedy next. Preferably Michael Bigman, because I want to see how he goes against a fringe top 10 contender in the middleweight division. Well, guys, that's it for right now. Peace.